Hello guys, this is Bench Design. Today we will learn how we can create this amazing 3D effect using Adobe Photoshop. So first, we are going to open a source file that is our mobile and we are going to place an object that is our dolphin on it to give it a realistic 3D effect. So before we start doing anything, let's just make a copy of it by pressing command plus J uh it makes a copy of it just to make sure if something goes wrong we can always go back to our source material so now we turn this layer off select layer one click on lasso tool the press uh, you can press l for its shortcut now that we have selected lasso tool let's just select no i think i've missed one corner let's just start it again from here i've selected this corner to here and okay now that it's selected you can either click on the vector mask and do it that way uh, but I like to keep things simple so now I'm gonna select brush tool keep the foreg foreground color to black and paint it over okay now that the screen turns to black we press command plus J to make a copy of our selection that is the black okay so now whatever we do it's going to be on this layer that is layer 2 okay now we'll click on file again place embedded and put our dolphin okay now let's just see where exactly it is uh, make a bit smaller adjust it a bit just a little bit just like here or no because yes that's fine for now and now we hit ok increase the opacity back to 50% select quick selection tool or you can press W for its shortcut select the dolphin you don't have to be super perfect because eventually all the details will come back and now that we have our selection we are going to click on layer mask okay now what we'll do is we are going to clip this layer on layer below how we can do that you can either press alt and you will see this arrow and you click and it will clip it to the layer above okay now you make a copy of this layer by pressing command plus J again so we get the head back we select the lower layer mask select the brush tool again by pressing B Make sure that the foreground color is black and paint it over. I'm sorry, the foreground color should be white. Okay, so as you can see, all the details that we lost just came back, just like this. And the job's done. Now, the water on the dolphin it kind of bothers me so now what I'll do is I'm gonna select the first layer which is on top of everything select the layer mask change the foreground color to black and just press a few times to make to just remove the blues that's it that's it just a little bit more 
okay so you see we <coughs> i'm extremely sorry so now you see we only used four layers and we managed to get this result now we'll do some color grading to make it look more appealing so for that we're gonna click on color adjustment layer here click on levels click blue set the output level to about 12 to 240 this is completely your preference how you would like to do so this i'm gonna increase it to 34 somewhat around here yes and increase it just a little bit 244 okay so now you can see the difference just a subtle difference but it's there okay now let's just go for color lookup because it's my all-time favorite and edgy ember okay we change the blend mode from normal to overlay and decrease the opacity to about 38 percent so it gives a very subtle effect as you can see this it's not so subtle subtle but it's there so you get the idea so you can just play around with it to get what you need so yeah congratulations now you know how you can achieve this 3d result just by using few layers so thank you again for watching and please make sure to subscribe it really helps me a lot so thank you until i see you next time bye